In today's video, I'll be going over the freezer burn mission in Act 1, as this mission requires you to freeze 50 zombies with cryo freeze and then freeze 10 hellhounds on top of that. This quest is actually really difficult to complete, so hopefully in today's video I will be able to let you know a strategy that personally for me worked very well. With Modern Warfare Zombies, it is a very heavily co-op based mode, but this strategy will be doable in solo, but if you do want to find people to play with, there's always a comment section on the video and also we do have a Discord server link down in the description if you do want to find some people to play with. Back to the quest itself, the first thing is the weapon that you will be using and this is quite important as you don't want a weapon that will be dealing a lot of damage and the one that I recommend for you to use is a pistol. The reason you want a pistol is because well it doesn't do a lot of damage and also you are able to shoot one bullet. The whole idea with this challenge is do not kill the zombie with cryo freeze. You want to specifically freeze them. And the most difficult one will be the hellhounds. So for this, what you want to do is also find cryo freeze. Personally, it can be a bit easy, but it also can be a bit challenging. For completing the take up arms mission in act one, the first part, you will actually get a cryo freeze ammo mod acquisition, which is essentially the thing that will allow you to put on a cryo freeze whenever you decide to spawn in. If you do not have this or use this already up, other ways that you can find cryo freeze is simply by looting chests, completing objectives and searching the rewards that you get and honestly that's the best thing that I can really recommend for you. It took me almost a full match to find a cryo freeze again after using mine up and it is really RNG based but once you have a cryo freeze what you want to do is spawn in with a pistol with no attachments as you don't really need any and when you do this instantly run over to a mystery box. The reason you want to run over to a mystery box is because you want a weapon that is a better rarity or better than your pistol itself so this is more RNG based but before you run over to the mystery box of course you you don't have points. So how will you get this? Accept some kind of objective around the area, preferably a weapon stash one, something that can give you just around 2000 points. The reason you want 2000 points is again, that gives you around two spins on the mystery box. And if you're playing with friends, you could also share your essence together to get more points if need be. Personally, in my game, I did actually get a haymaker of purple rarity, which was exactly what I was looking for. From here, what I did was run into tier two region, because this is where you're going to be able to complete this quest super easy. Inside of here, zombies have more health. So your great pistol with cryo freeze that you equip on it will not really be killing them super fast. So straight off the bat, if you enter into this region, just start shooting zombies with one bullet, which will end up completing your 50 zombies frozen with cryo freeze. But specifically with the dogs, what I ended up doing was accepting another weapon stash mission. And with the weapon stash mission, you don't exactly have to be completing the actual quest itself. You can be far away from it. Now, obviously the timer or the percentage on it gets taken down, but it does doesn't fail completely. So what you can do is simply stay by the weapon cache itself and wait until zombies spawn in. Then there is a chance that dogs will end up spawning in after some time and they usually do spawn in twos. From here what you want to do is the good old training system. Start running around the place and using your pistol start shooting them and hoping for the best. But do not put in a whole magazine into that dog as it is very very important that you only shoot it one bullet each time to see if a little icon pops up that freezes the dog. And that's kind of the basic idea. The reason you want that shotgun is so you can get out of sticky situations as you will probably end up being in them and you could potentially even gather points beforehand and pack a punch that mystery box weapon or a weapon that is higher rarity so that you can always have a backup but make sure you're using a weapon that isn't strong shoots one bullet so that you can 100% freeze the hellhounds and not actually kill them as that is what ended up happening to me a lot and you should be able to complete this super fast after thinking of this method and testing it out I completed that with just a few dogs I needed I think seven and I got them within like two minutes of actually training them around the place or even faster. So this is a really good strategy. So again, to quickly go over, spawn in, with a pistol, equip cryo freeze on it, or if you happen to find cryo freeze while completing your first quest, then go to the mystery box. You can go into a second region mystery box and get a really insane rarity weapon, but that can be risky if you just go in with a pistol. So go to the gray area, spin the mystery box, hope you get a weapon that is actually good enough to take out some zombies, go inside of the area, look for dogs or accept a quest like the weapon stash and shoot those dogs, but be careful to not fully kill them. And all you have to do is just freeze them. The whole idea is to slow them down and keep checking your quest completion as it should let you know if you do it and the way you do know that you complete a quest is if a perca cola does show up anyway ladies and gentlemen i just wanted to explain this one as i really struggled with this mission and i feel like i'm not the only one out there so hopefully this strategy does help you out in some kind of way again if you have any questions be sure to comment down below and on top of all of that be sure to subscribe you should drop a like on the video as it does really help out and be sure to check out our discord server anyway ladies and gentlemen i'll see you guys next one
Peace out.